Hey there, everyone. Quick question for you. Have you ever wondered if the foods you're eating might be making your arthritis worse? You might be surprised to learn that some everyday favorites could be the culprits behind your painful flare-ups. Today, we're revealing the 12 most dangerous foods for arthritis that you probably overlook. Trust me, you don't want to miss this. It could change your life. So stick around because we're diving right in. And by the end of this video, you'll know exactly what to avoid to keep those joints happy and healthy. Let's get started. 1. Sugar. We all love a sweet treat now and then. But did you know sugar is a major culprit for inflammation? Consuming sugary foods and drinks can trigger the release of inflammatory messengers called cytokines, worsening arthritis symptoms. Next time you're reaching for that candy bar or soda, think twice. Red meat. Juicy steaks and burgers might be delicious, but red meat contains high levels of saturated fats, which can increase inflammation. Additionally, Red meat has a compound called advanced glycation end products, ages, that can stimulate inflammation. Opt for leaner protein sources like fish or plant-based proteins instead. Dairy products. For some people with arthritis, dairy can be a hidden trigger. Dairy products can cause inflammation due to the type of proteins they contain. If you notice your symptoms flare up after consuming cheese, milk, or yogurt, try switching to non-dairy alternatives like almond milk or coconut yogurt. For gluten. Gluten found in wheat, barley, and rye can be problematic for those with arthritis, especially if you have a sensitivity or celiac disease. Even if you're not diagnosed with a gluten issue, some people report feeling better on a gluten-free diet. It's worth experimenting to see if it helps reduce your inflammation. Processed foods. Processed foods are often packed with unhealthy fats, sugars, and preservatives, all of which can aggravate arthritis. Fast food, packaged snacks, and ready-made meals are convenient but can wreak havoc on your joints. Try to cook fresh meals at home to keep inflammation in check. Fried foods. Those crispy golden delights like French fries and fried chicken might taste heavenly, but they're loaded with trans fats and can lead to increased inflammation. Baking or grilling your food can be a healthier alternative that's still delicious. Salt. Too much salt can cause your cells to retain water, leading to swollen joints. Processed and prepackaged foods often contain high amounts of salt, so always check the labels. Try seasoning your food with herbs and spices instead. Alcohol. While a glass of wine or beer might help you unwind, excessive alcohol consumption can increase inflammation and exacerbate arthritis symptoms. Moderation is key. Try limiting your intake and see if your joints feel better. Refined carbohydrates. White bread, pasta, and pastries can spike your blood sugar and increase inflammation. Whole grains are a better option as they have anti-inflammatory properties and can keep your blood sugar levels steady. Artificial additives. Artificial sweeteners and preservatives can be found in many low calorie and diet foods. These additives can lead to inflammation and other health issues. Stick to natural foods and sweeteners like honey or maple syrup. Nightshade vegetables. This one might surprise you. Tomatoes, potatoes, eggplants, and peppers belong to the nightshade family, which can cause inflammation in some people with arthritis. If you suspect these veggies might be affecting you, Try eliminating them for a few weeks to see if your symptoms improve. Certain oils, corn, safflower, sunflower, and soybean oils are high in omega-6 fatty acids, which can promote inflammation if consumed in excess. Instead, use oils rich in omega-3s like olive oil or flaxseed oil, which have anti-inflammatory properties. Conclusion. There you have it. 12 foods that could be making your arthritis worse without you even realizing it. By cutting these out of your diet, you might see a significant improvement in your symptoms. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tips on managing arthritis and living a healthier life. And as always, drop your thoughts and questions in the comments below. We love hearing from you. Stay healthy, stay happy, and we'll see you in the next video.